Welcome back to Tasty Yet Healthy. I'm Tracy, and thanks for joining me today in my kitchen. This is where every week I bring you recipes that I cook for my family. And today we're focusing on snacks, specifically almond oat bars. When you're trying to lose weight, having snacks on hand is so important. For me especially, in the evening, I like to snack on something. I get the munchies, and if I don't have a pre-planned snack, then I'm going to probably grab something that's not very healthy. So today we're going to make a snack that is tasty yet healthy. So today's snack does have a little bit of prep work, but let's get cooking. All right, so we're gonna get started right away on these almond oat bars. The very first thing that we wanna do is to roast our almonds. So today I'm using the already sliced um, salad almonds. So they're thin slivers. And this is gonna make the toasting very fast. So we're gonna put it on a medium heat, medium heat here. And all we're, we're not even gonna put anything in the pan. We're just gonna put our almonds in there and stir them around for just th about three minutes or so. And we have about a half a cup here. And just stir them. You're gonna start to smell them as they're, they're roasting, and that's what we want. That is releasing the oils that are inside of it, which is gonna bring out a really delicious flavor in our bars. Okay, so our almonds are all nice and toasted. They smell fantastic. They make me just wanna taste one. Um, so like I said, that was a half a cup of almonds that we toasted there. We're gonna crush them up in just a few minutes and put them in our bowl with all of our ingredients. Um, but we're gonna let them cool. And so we have one cup of oats that we're gonna put in the bowl here. We have a half a cup of raisins. And then we have a peanut butter substitute. It is tahini. So what is tahini? We're gonna pour it in here. Okay, so tahini, what is it? It is sesame seeds, that's it. We're just replacing peanut butter today with this. And it's organic. A lot of times you can't find it at um, a regular grocery store. One time, sometimes you can, like um, I've never been able to find it at the Walmart near me, but in any Whole Foods store or organic store, you can find it. And that's all it is, just sesame seeds. It gives it a real good flavor. And if you would rather use peanut butter, you can for this recipe also. Then we're gonna pour in a third cup of maple syrup. And we have one and a half teaspoons of cinnamon. And we have one teaspoon of vanilla. We're just gonna stir it first and then we're gonna add our crushed almonds. All right, so now we're just gonna give it a good stir, stir in those almonds. And once that's all good together, we're gonna put it all in a loaf pan. So I just have my loaf pan here. I don't know if you've ever learned this trick before, but we're using parchment paper lined to hold your parchment plate paper in place. I like to put a rubber band around it and it actually keeps it where you need so it doesn't slide all over the place. But we're gonna put our um, bars in here, kind of pat it in there, and then we're gonna stick it in the freezer and you wanna leave it in the freezer for about an hour and then they're good to go. All right. Our almond oat bars are all done. They've been in the freezer for just over an hour. Got them all put into our bar size and ready for this healthy snack. Remember that when you're trying to eat healthy, you don't have to eliminate all snacks from your diet. 
you just have to put in healthy ingredients. We are using maple syrup in this recipe, so we're not even eliminating all sugars from our diet. We're just putting in healthier choices. One of these bars is a serving, so um, you may want to not eat half of that all, all at one time, although it is possible to do. Um, but when you're having snacks, they can be tasty yet healthy. So let's try it out, see how it tastes. Mmm, that's actually surprising sometimes how good it is. But you really get a good almond flavor out, out of these when we roast them. And just taste really good. And um, so give it a try. It's really easy to make. Hope you enjoy them. Check out my other healthy yet tasty snacks. Like the channel or like this video. And if you know anybody that's trying to lose weight but is having a hard time because diets are too restrictive, share this video. Let them see and make a healthy change in their life. See you next time in the Tasty Yet Healthy Kitchen.